And we're going to speak something to send the angels of heaven and the Holy Spirit to pursue our family members that don't know Christ. Amen? Amen. And then we're going to call forth some things. Okay, first we'll do our warring. Then we're going to call forth some things to be created here in this country. Amen? Amen. Amen. I always like to tell people what you're going to be doing. And it will be very powerful in the spirit. And they'll be like shouting in heaven when we do it. Because they'll see you operating the way you're supposed to operate. You're not supposed to run outside and say, Dear God, what are we going to do? He'll look down and go, Well, what are you doing? <laughs> what are you going to say? What are you going to create with your words? What atmosphere will you have in your home? What kind of cloud will you have around you? The Peter released the anointing so much it made a cloud outside of him. And when he passed by people, they would be healed and demons would run out. It wasn't his shadow. They didn't know how to, they didn't know how to describe it. It was the anointing he walked in. And they released it. The more you release it, the bigger that cloud gets. It looks like a fiery cloud. It's not like a little white cloud outside. It's like a fiery cloud that is around you. And guess what the enemy sees? The fiery cloud. <laughs> That's what's inside of you. And tonight, we're going to let it out. Amen? So first we're going to say, Father, Father, I thank you for making me. I thank you for making me. For timing my birth on the earth. For timing my birth on the earth. For right now. For right now. And something great is going to happen. Something great is going to happen. I will be a part of that. I will be a part of that. Yes. Yes. Amen? Yes. And now we're going to say this. I repent. I repent. For every sin. For every sin. Known or unknown. Known or unknown. For every hateful, mean word every hateful, mean I have word, ever spoken, I'm not, I'm not keeping that. I lose it from my soul. I, I, from my soul. I want to be filled with you, I want to be filled with and, you your son, and your Son and Holy Spirit. And Holy Spirit. I, want to be dangerous I want to be dangerous against Hell's plans. Against hell's plans. Amen. Amen. Say, so Father, so Father, I ask you, I ask you, stir up the anointing, stir up the anointing, abide in me, abide in me, because I'm going to release it, because I'm going to release it. I declare, I declare, as your child, as your child, and as a, as a believer in Christ Jesus, as a believer in Christ Jesus, I release the anointing, I release the anointing, that breaks every yoke of darkness, I declare, I declare. 
Christ. I take power. I take power. Over all the power of the enemy. Controlling the fake news. And the liars. And the liars. And the stealers. And the stealers. I take power. I take power. Over all those activities. That they will be exposed. I declare, I declare the truth will be made known. The truth will be made known. And I receive it. And I receive it. In Jesus' name. In Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. I thank you, Jesus. I thank you, Jesus. For dying for me. For dying for me. And raising for me. And raising for me. That your blood, that your blood has, set me free. has set me free. I agree, I agree with, your statement with your statement that we have power over all the power of the enemy. So I ask for justice on behalf of myself and my family that they will not have anything taken from them, destroyed on their, against their behalf, but we will be free, my family will be free, we will live in this country with liberty, freedom, justice, and righteousness in Jesus' name, amen. I thank you, Jesus, for your word, for your written word, and your spoken word. I receive them as life for my body, for my spirit, for my soul. Give me a hunger to read them so I will know all your promises and I will learn your ways. I will walk in them. And I declare in this moment, in this day, that my family members will be free from the enemy. Your word says you desire that the vilest sinner be set free. You desire that none should perish. So we speak the life of God and the word of God and the plans of God for our family members. They will come to know Christ. They will not miss their destiny. They become the living testimony of the saving power of Jesus Christ. So be it. Now we're going to be creators. <laughs> Father, I thank you. Father, I thank you for your son. For your son in your sacrifice. In your sacrifice for us. For us. I declare. I declare this nation is changing. This nation is changing. I thank you. I thank you for new and witty ideas. For new and witty ideas. New inventions, new inventions to come to this land that will help man, that will 
help our lives to prosper. That we can live in health. That we can help one another and care for one another with these new inventions. We declare, if you give me witty ideas, I will use them for your plans and your purposes. So send them down. In Jesus' name, I receive it. Just hold them forward this way. It's okay, fine. I declare. I declare. In the name of Jesus Christ. In the name of Jesus Christ. That hope. That hope will come to this country. Will come to this country. I call hope. I call hope to come. To come. I call peace. I call peace. That surpasses all understanding. To this nation, to this nation, to its people, to its people, to its friends, to its friends, to our government, to our government, that the souls of the people, that the souls of the people that have been wounded, that have been wounded and compromised, and compromised will, be whole. will be whole. We thank you for pouring out. We thank you for pouring out your presence. Your presence. Your love. Your love. Your life. Your life. Churches and the, church. and the government, and the government. Right, now. right now, in Jesus' name, in Jesus name. I, declare. I 